Hello and thanks for watching. This video is about how to activate your Google Drive in Schoology so you can turn in Google Docs and other things from your drive. You start here on your home page. This is a sample student and you go to the resources tab. You come down to apps. Once there, Google Drive is so popular it's listed and kind of preloaded. Otherwise, you would go to install apps and scroll through the list and find it. I'm going to go to Google Drive and I'm going to authorize Schoology to access the Google Drive account for this fake student. So I'm confirming I want to connect and then I would enter some information that would help me connect this account and let me turn in things. And as you can see, here's a list of all the documents saved in Google Drive, including PDFs, spreadsheets, and presentations. And here's what it looks like when our student turns in an assignment. They're in science class, they got the important assignment coming up, and here's the reminder. They go into the assignment, and when they get there, they want to click Submit Assignment or Resubmit Assignment. And in this case, it's going to take them to the standard assignment turn in choices upload, create, or now we're using resources. And in resources, we're looking for a particular app. So I'll come over here to the list of apps, and we've got the Google Drive resource app right here. And it takes a moment to load, but what it does is it lists all the uh, all of the documents in Google Drive in order of the most recently opened. So I'm going to grab uh, the brand new document over here, the thing I need to turn in. And once I tick this box, a new drop down menu appears up here, the import, and I go to import file. And it's turning into a Word document, so it's freezing that, and I as a student can still edit it, but the teacher gets a static, unchanging copy of that assignment where it was at that moment in time.